Okay. Well, I'm not sure exactly um, where we were at. I think we were still continuing heading to the east. We have mapped down all these sectors here to the southeast of our home sector, Splitfire. They still seem to be doing good back there. Haven't had any distress calls or anything from our, our network, our satellite network. Um, our ultimate destination where we're going to go is over here on Omicron Lyri. I think we're actually just going to go ahead and use the jump drive and jump to it. We'll bypass going through all those other sectors. Basically, there's a ship over here called, I think it's an Executioner. I'll know its name, Exterminator, that's what it is. And we're going to go ahead and search for the Exterminators and then try to join up with their cause. Seeing as how all the major races seem to be at peace right now, we'll join the, the battle against the AI. Entering system autopilot. Pilot, we have some Terran diplomats in need of escorting back to the sector Heretics End. Hmm. We'd like to show them how we handle things around here. This will look good on your record. I'm loading the briefing into your mission menu now. Unfortunately, follow the instructions. Unfortunately, I can't do this mission because it is bugged. Due to one of the mods I'm using, the ship I'm supposed to escort begins randomly. Um, jumping through hyperspace just about once every tenth of a second. I think I have a clip of it. Let me splice it in real quick. I'll show you. And that was it. So that's why we can't do it. It just jumps around. It never reaches its destination. It just flies all over the place. Let's cut our engines for a moment. Take a look at this place. Um, it remains true to the courage and conviction of those who knew that this sector would not be the last will and testament to the battle fought against the Ka. Here lie the souls of those not forgotten, those who understood that this would be the point at which all races would stand tall and take the battle onwards. Those remaining here are neither forsaken nor left without hope. Life goes on, while in the shadows lurk the destroyers of worlds. And... If I can find the right ship... We're going to join the battle against the Destroyer of Worlds. Let's see, which gates do we have? Might have to head west. Yep, we'll fly through this one. Because I know this ship is, will turn up somewhere in one of these sectors. They, are, they patrol these um, sectors, the Argon sectors over here, pretty heavily. From what I remember correctly. They are members of the OFF. There is one already. Exterminator. Um, let's open up comms What's with them. Up, dude? Hey, what are all these ships doing, man? Hey there, man. This is Operational Final Fury. You really didn't know? We're gonna shove it to them insects just like my man JB did. Gonna force them out for good. Uh, who's JB? I'm not from this area. Julian Brennan. He's one cool guy. Practically saved the whole damn universe by himself. Now I'm gonna do the same. I'm with you. We'll save it alone, together. Okay, so there's a campaign underway to wipe out the car. Damn right, man, there sure is. Joint Operation Split. Talati, Three Eyes, even the squiddy things. We got them on a the run. Come with me, man, and let's show them who runs this place. We don't have two eyes. We don't exactly have three eyes, either. It's a long story for another time, I would imagine. Maybe the Paranids will tell it to you someday. Um, but for now, I think, how about where do we sign up? Right on. I'm just Sam, by the way. All right, I've sent your ID to the boss. Tell got me back to Black Hole Sun, and let's rock him. Roger that, so let's target him. Where is he at? Right there. And we'll set him on autopilot. Autopilot follow. Autopilot activated. And I'll just turn SATA on, we'll follow him until something happens. Looks like he might have a, even have a flight wing with him. What do we got here? Argon Discoverer Argon. and Argon Your Nova. So he might have two wingmen. Of course, we are the big Corvette ship class in this flight group right now. I don't know where all the other Corvettes are in the universe. It is rather large, so no telling. They're probably out there doing combat maneuvers and getting to have all the fun. Where 
is Black Hole Sun. On the map, you can try to type in the first letter of the sector's name, and you can cycle through it. So B will cycle through all the Bs. Unfortunately, that didn't open it up, accepting this quest. Mission is ho pro high profile escort. Um, activate guidance to Operation Final Fury. Yep, follow this guy right here. So again, I'm just gonna leave Seda on, and I'll come back once we reach some place, wherever he's taking us. It might be a while. You have gained recognition. Actually, I guess I could take this time while we're following him, and we're now a confirmed friend. We will have a little bit of time here. So let's pull up the uh, Galactic News Network. Um, let's see. The article Tensions Rise, Protest Outside Split Embassy, Galnet Special, Weapons at War, the Ion Disruptor, an in-depth look at the details behind this weapon. Arson Accusation, an insult to the race, uh, Space Weed is a medical supplement. It's still illegal in most sectors, even though a few are starting to test out the medical medical myth behind it. We'll see if the pirates are telling the truth. IGF Tournament Art or War? You decide tonight at 9. And Boron Royal shrugs off rumors. Let's see what's going on with the tensions. Tensions rose to new heights today between the Argon and Split. The captain of the Argon destroyer, Hammer, had to take evasive action after repeated warnings to a nearby Split transporter to stay clear. The transporter carrying four passengers collided with the destroyer, killing all on board. The destroyer's captain later said they could have had system malfunctions, but it did look like a deliberate attack. And we're getting ready to go through the gate. Somebody's fighting. ATF and Paranid. Well, bring a ship that doesn't teleport all over the place next time, guys, and I'll go. Oh, well, that news article wasn't very important anyways. It is nice, It is good news to know the Paranet are fighting the ATF now, hopefully. Fingers crossed. Entering system. There we go. Treasure chest. Autopilot off. Argon Recon Mammoth and... Exterminator. It's about 8 kilometers that way. Really hope you Argons have more ships than these mammoths flying around. Flying trailers. I'm surprised those things don't mount more guns with as large as they are. It's a waste of space if you ask me. What do we got in this sector? A whole bunch of Argon ships. Novas, Busters, Discoverers. A Mercury with a mission. Taladi, a Plutarch, an energy transporter. Um, let's use our salvage command software and scan for any ships. Scan complete. Is there any derelict things here? In treasure chest, there's an M4 Buster Sentinel. Buster Sentinel. Man, that's way away. It's an M4. Let's see. The Argon Buster was once the pride of the Argon fleet and was instrumental in the Argon victory in the Xenon conflict. However, during the Boron campaign, it was superseded by the Argon elite. It can have 275 megawatts, I think that's what it is. 4x5 megajoule shields. We'll go pick it up. Actually, yeah, we'll pick it up. I'm not sure, we might eject one of our cause scouts and put this M4 on our side instead. Just to have kind of a variation. We'll see where its autopilot computer takes it. It'll no doubt take it to some shipyard, even though it's fully repaired. No haul damage. I don't see anything wrong with it, it's kind of weird. It's right there, just perfect, perfect condition. It's still powered up. I wonder what's going on with it. Um, go ahead and scan this. Claim it, computer. This object is owned by you. Um, trans make sure you transfer all the paperwork to the Galactic ID network. Let them know that the ship's now ours. 
Um, it's going to Federal Argon Shipyard. We'll let it be our eyes through this sector. Or through these sectors, anyways. We gotta fly all this way back here. Follow this ship. We'll put the autopilot on him. And let's see what the Galactic News Network has today. Jump drive cells defended. Argon government admits policy of assassination. Large spacefly swarms discovered. Uh, maybe it's not the Xenon? And the blue flu strikes again. Let's see what's going on with the blue flu. Wiped through several planets, I believe. Dockers at the largest spaceport on Circle of Labor have not reported in for work today. It is an unofficial strike has been called by union leaders demanding a total over overhaul of procedures relating to the docking systems at the spaceport. This follows a recent accident when an Argon Mercury tried to take off whilst another was landing. The cause of this tr crash was the station's traffic control computer, which allowed two landing pads to be engaged at the same time. The station's software has recently been upgraded by Carpolis traffic control systems, who were unavailable for comment. The dockers have yet to comment, but it is believed that the doctors will not return to work until management can guarantee their safety. Talks between the unions and management take place later today.